Hi folks, this is 5 Magnolia Place. It's a single family property in Dorchester. This is a dead end street. This is currently on the market for $99,000. It's a three room. This is the end of the uh, street here. It's a three room, one and a half bathroom. Uh, single family with the mansard roof as uh, you might be able to see there. And uh, that's the top of the street there, okay? So we're not gonna go in through the front door. We're gonna go through in the, ba go through in the back door here. Uh, and let's take a look. So we're going to walk up the uh, the driveway, and uh, we'll try to make this as quick as possible. Uh, this is the backyard. It's not much of a backyard, quite honestly. So just a small little lot. All right. So let's take a look. It needs a lot of work. Uh, we're going to walk into the kitchen here, and the kitchen. I would say needs to be replaced. It's a combination of uh, late 80s, and that's probably, you know, probably, yeah, that's probably 10 years old. But again, kitchen's probably going to need to be replaced at some point. Yeah, actually, probably in the near future. This is uh, some leakage, it looks like, from, the, from either the bathroom above or the, um, the roof. Uh, do we have any light in here? We do have a little bit of light. This is the half bathroom off the kitchen. Uh, and again, this needs work as well. Uh, that window needs to be replaced. And there's a drop ceiling that's been opened up and it's got about uh, 12, 12 foot ceilings, I would say. But anyway, all right, that's enough with the, uh, with the bathroom here. Okay, so we're gonna walk into the dining room. It's got not really nice hardwood floors. They, they do need to be refinished. It's a closet in the dining room there. They probably put china back in back there when this was first built. It's got a, a medallion in the center, okay? And a lot of the windows in this property have been replaced. Uh, again, the hardwood floors, this is the living room, and that's a little bow area here. The living room has an awesome uh, marble mantle. It's really, really, really super nice. I'm gonna knock on it. All right, so they put a uh, cast iron stove in there. And then we're now in the front hallway uh, off of the uh, living room and that back uh, entrance you'll see goes into the dining room. And this is the front staircase. Uh, as you would, as, as, This is where you would come in from the front door. All right, nice little uh, entryway here. So this property needs a ton of work. And these are, this is the second level here. Three bedrooms and a full bath in this level. We're gonna walk straight into the master. And uh, I did notice that there's some water damage up there, okay? So newer window, actually that back window is a replacement window, but it's a little bit older. But there are a lot of newer windows in this, um, in this uh, single family, okay? Now we're gonna walk over to the uh, full bathroom, which is, is to the rear of the property, okay? You know, this needs to be replaced. This bathroom, they love drop ceilings in this. That's the chimney, that's gonna need to be replaced or fixed or taken down. That's a tar and gravel roof off the back of the property and that's where the kitchen is, okay? And here is the hallway. We're gonna go left into the second bedroom here. And this bedroom is not quite as large as the master but it's still a, it's still a pretty fair size. I would say it's probably 12 or 13 feet by, I'd say it's about 13 by 13, I would, or 12 by 13, I would say. Somewhere in that neighborhood, okay? Um, and this is the front, as you're looking at the, as you're looking at the uh, property from the street, this is the front right hand, second floor level. And then we're gonna walk into the third bed, bedroom, which is really, really tiny, okay? This would be uh, probably used as a nursery, or a computer room or something like that. I guess it, you could put a single bed in here as well. Okay, it's uh, probably around eight feet wide by nine feet in the length. That's not official, by the way. I don't wanna be called on that in case you're trying to rent to a Section 8 tenant and they need 70 square feet. So, all right. Let's head down to the basement and uh, We'll take a look at the electrical and the heating system. All right, 
heating, uh, electrical, 100 amp service, circuit breakers, it's probably been done in the last 10 years or so. Here's your uh, electrical outlet for the uh, dryer. Then you have a washer hookup. There's your gas meter. There's a, um, a sink in the basement as well. I don't know if you can see it back here. You probably can't. That's your oil tank. This is your heating system, uh, which is forced hot air by oil. All right. This is the back of, uh, that's the side door. So if you're looking at the property, that would uh, lead you out to the driveway. And here's the rear of the property. There are about two inches of water back here. This is probably underneath the kitchen. This was an addition that they put onto the property at some point. Okay. So that is the showing for Five Magnolia Place. It came on the market yesterday for $99,000. It definitely needs work, but it definitely has potential. Uh, but you're going to have to spend some money on this property. Let me just shut off these lights here. And uh, we'll walk out to the front of the building real quick. All right. If you have any questions, you can give me a call. My name is Jonathan Bowen with uh, Jonathan Bowen Real Estate. We're in Hyde Park. Um, my office number is 617-364-8350. Again, 617-364-8350. And my web address is uh, www.bowenboston.com. Again, www.bowenboston.com. Thanks for taking the time, folks. Have a good day. Bye-bye.